Hi, my name is Johannes and I'm CTO at Technia. In this session, I will give a brief introduction to a topic which is getting a lot of interest these days, model-based system engineering or MBSC for short. So what is the reason for this growing interest in model-based system engineering? Well, the main reason is the growing complexity of products. For instance, when I got my first car back in the 80s, it was basically a mechanical product. It had very few electric functions. The cabling was quite simple and it clearly didn't have any software at all. Moving into the 90s, cars started to get a rapidly growing amount of electronics with highly specialized controllers and the harnesses to connect all of that became very complex. Today, we are at a point where a car is becoming a computer on wheels with a centralized computer running an operating system, implementing artificial intelligence and autonomous functions. Part of this is to also to provide connectivity and machine to machine communication to backend systems and to other cars on the street. The car is becoming a complex system of systems with a rapidly growing amount of software. So it is quite clear that new tools and new methods are needed to master this complexity moving forward. Systems engineering as a methodology is not a new invention, but traditionally the different elements of a system has been described in static and quite often disconnected documents. Moving from documents to models made possible by system modeling tools like Katia Magic allows for a much tighter collaboration between the different stakeholders and for fast iterations as requirements are changing. A system model is a live representation of a system or product which allows for simulation of behaviors as well as full traceability from requirement to validated solution. Implemented properly, MBSC bridges the gap between the engineering disciplines which ultimately leads to better performing products. Using a collaboration platform like 3D Experience to manage the system model greatly improves the collaboration and visibility, and it allows product developing companies to work model-based from cradle to grave. In conclusion, model-based system engineering is a critical piece in the puzzle to realize virtual twins and model-based methodologies. To illustrate what this means in more practical terms, I would like to share an example from our customer Kongsberg Defense and Aerospace. Every summer, a group of students are given the task of designing and developing an autonomous drone called the Local Hawk. While this is still a quite simple product, it requires the collaboration of several engineering disciplines, including mechanical, electrical, software, and aerodynamics. In a traditional way of working, a huge amount of documents would have to be created to fully describe all aspects of such a product. Switching to a model-based way of working, the documentation effort can be greatly simplified. When working model-based, the model, or rather models, are the main carriers of information. The mechanical design is captured as a 3D model. The structural strength is verified using a finite element model and the behavior of the system is described as a system model. The system model contains requirements, use cases, state diagrams, logical building blocks, test cases, and more. Tying all these elements together put you in full control of all important aspects of a product to much better predict how it will perform in real life. After the product is put into operation, the system model provides full traceability to quickly find the root cause in case of failure during operation. In summary, model-based system engineering is a very efficient approach to rationalize complex systems development. The system model connects all engineering disciplines and provides full traceability from requirement to final solution. Model-based system engineering allow engineers to focus on improving the product rather than 
writing documentation. Don't hesitate to get in touch to learn more about metal-based system engineering and how Technia can help you on that journey. Thanks for watching.